Following in the footsteps of her father, a lawyer and legislator, Mary Payne dedicated herself to justice at an early age, beginning her nearly six-decade career as a lawyer in 1955 and retiring as a judge for the Mississippi Court of Appeals in 2001. During her formative years growing up in Mississippi, it's clear that the biggest influence in Judge Payne's life was her father, Reese O. Bickerstaff, a five-term state legislator who often invited her to witness his work firsthand. As legislator, he took foreign dignitaries out to dinner and always involved his family in the outings and conversations. It was around junior high school when she realized that in order to make a real living out of ballet, her passion, she would have to move to New York. Taking into consideration how far she would be from Mississippi and her father if she did this, she decided that she couldn't go through with it. While at the University of Mississippi in 1950, she relied heavily on her faith in God to help her decide what she wanted to do with her life. Juggling between becoming a social worker or lawyer, knowing that she wanted to help people no matter what the specific field was. One day, while in her father's library, she consumed his law books and eventually took an aptitude test which showed that she should pursue jurisprudence. After several council sessions with spiritual mentors at the time and several visits to a prayer garden at school, she decided that it was destiny for her to go into law like her father. Judge Payne completed coursework at the Mississippi University for Women from 1950 to 1952 and graduated from the University of Mississippi with a Bachelor of Arts in Political Science with distinction in 1954 and an LLB in 1955. She was admitted to practice law in the state of Mississippi in 1955 and became a fellow of the American Bar Foundation. From there, she climbed the ladder. She was secretary with Guaranteed Title Company in 1957, an associate with Henley Jones and Henley from 1958 to 1981, a solo practitioner from 1963 to 1968, and executive director of the Mississippi Judiciary Commission for two years starting in 1968. From 1975 to 1978, she became the founding dean and associate professor in the School of Law at Mississippi College and up until 1994, she served as a professor at the college, then became a scholar in residence and professor emerita from 2003 to 2012. She rounded out her career by serving as a judge on the Mississippi Court of Appeals from 1995 to 2001. Additionally, Judge Payne served on the board of directors for the Exchange Club's Child Abuse Prevention Center and was an advisor with the Covenant Ministerial Fellowship for many years. She has been honored for her consistent trailblazing as well, winning a Woman Trailblazer Award in 2012 and an Outstanding Woman Lawyer Award in 1999, among several others. In her free time, she likes to travel, sew, and write. Judge Payne is the author of A Goodly Heritage, a memoir of Mississippi College School of Law, which came out in 2001, on top of several articles and essays. Of all her achievements, though, Judge Payne said that her greatest was marrying her husband, the late Bobby R. Payne.